Back to his left in the gun. Gonna pull it himself, look around the edge. He's got the outside. Gonna turn up field and touchdown, Starkville. The Yellow Jackets score on the very first offensive drive of the game, right? Immediate pressure, but he's gonna loft one deep up to turnip seed, and it's gonna be caught inside the 20 at about the 18 yard line. Fantastic turnaround catch from Jaden Turnip Seed. Running back to his left in the gun. Gonna pull it himself, look around the edge. He's got the outside. Gonna turn up field and touchdown, Starkville. The Yellow Jackets score on the very first offensive drive of the game. Grandjean fakes the throw quickly. Pegues has only one man to beat and he's in for the end zone. Fantastic play call that time and a great fake from Peter Grandjean. If we could just go back and watch the quarterback on this pass play, Cody. Yeah, that was the wizardry. 18 seconds here on the play clock as the ball is snapped. Jay Stevenson steps over a man, makes another miss. Can anybody bring him down? And he's going to go out of bounds or at least be ruled down at about the one yard line. As quick as this drive is going, it means your defense doesn't have to be out there long when you're having long sustaining drives, which will keep Starkville's defense out there for a while. Haven't seen a signal yet. PA said touchdown. I don't see, I haven't seen a signal though. I was going to say PA said touchdown, but now the scoreboard says touchdown. Teen on the clock if they can stop Starkville on this play. Deep pass that time, and nobody in front of him on the sideline for quite some time. First down and into enemy territory for the Yellow Jackets. Isaiah Witherspoon able to bring that one down for the big game. Petty going to try and take it himself, finds a hole, makes a man miss, walks in, untouched. Touchdown, Starkville. Trey Petty shook that man out of his shoes. Petty. Going to take the snap, look downfield this time again to Witherspoon. He's going to try and leg it out. Touchdown, Yellow Jackets. I'm sorry, that is not Witherspoon. That's Braylon Burnside with his first touchdown of the night. Grand Jean handoff this time to Begees. That one's going to be a first down, but he fumbled. Starville going to fall on it. Number 20, Don Elvin Jordan. Lands on that one and a clean fumble. Ball was just poked free and the Yellow Jackets wind up on top of it. That's Braylon Burnside, knocked out that football. Making an impact on both sides of the ball here, Cody. To play with his college quarterback. Here we see the handoff to Cooper around the outside. Fantastic downfield blocking, has one man to beat. Did they keep him out? Yes, they did. They're gonna say no touchdown and rule him down on the one yard line. It's into his right. Keep an eye on Burnside on the right side. Eyes there he him. is. He's eyeing him down, but that's not his target. Actually, Burnside came up with it. My goodness, the pass is tipped by Philip Swan, and Praylon Burnside winds up coming down with it. I'm not sure if Swan was the intended target or if it was a bad throw. See it here. Goes to Swan, Burnside able to get it off of the tip. I have a hard time believing his target wasn't Burnside, uh, so we might get five downs here. Maybe so. Brown this time not going to mess around. Not going to matter either. Not going to matter. That time it's Jaquavius Brown finding the end zone for the Oxford Chargers. Their second touchdown of the night. And only one man deep. And it is another onside kick. And oh, it is bobbled. And I believe it is recovered by Oxford. They are. Oh my lord. Look at this. Two recoveries of onside kicks. This is, this is impressive. And standing in the shotgun, pockets collapsing. He's got yellow jackets all around him. Gonna try and fight him off, no avail. You know, <laughs> Brown came out of the pile with that ball. If we get a look at it here. I think Grand G handed end, it to him. Well, it looked like Brown was trying to rip it out of his arms to get going.